You are watching the Famous Room channel. Lana may be a real girl, but 90 Day Fiancé fans aren't convinced that she's everything that she says she is. After seven years of talking to David Murphy without ever showing him her face, Lana should have a lot of explaining to do. Instead, Murphy accepts her at face value and it's up whatever she says. On the finale of this season of 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Days, Murphy's private investigator gave him irrefutable proof that Lana was a scammer. Murphy kind of set himself up to be scammed by specifically seeking out women from other countries. When the internet was brand new, a tenant of mine showed me a website where you could meet Russian and Filipino women, he wrote in an Instagram Q&A. I had an interest in Russians. Within months, the Ukrainian women on the site outnumbered the Russians. I went to both countries. A few years later, Ukraine became more Western-like and you didn't even need a visa to go there. Russia requires a visa and you have to register everywhere you go, it was just harder to travel in. He's been searching for a Ukrainian woman to marry for years, meaning he was basically a sitting duck for scams. I stopped dating in the USA 15 years ago, he wrote. Every time I did, I would start thinking about Ukraine, so I stopped trying so my heart was free just in case I went to Ukraine. I have dated well over 100 women in Ukraine, turned down many marriage proposals and have been turned down twice myself. After trying to meet Lana for a fourth time without her showing up, Murphy hired a private investigator to find out more about her. I know I got a lot of lies from Lana, he said on the show. So I'm hoping the investigator will validate that Lana is who I think she is because I don't know if I'm ready to find out if my truth is not the truth. The investigator told him that Lana was scamming him. He truly believes that this is a scam, Murphy's friend Victoria translated the investigator's message. Because when they checked all data and all connections, they find out this girl has several dating accounts. Murphy refused to believe the investigator and went to Ukraine again anyway. While there, he met with the investigator in person. The investigator continued to tell Murphy that Lana was scamming him. Despite being fired by Murphy, the investigator sent him one last email in the hopes of making Murphy finally see the truth. In the email, the investigator included links to several of Lana's other dating profiles. She had different locations and different names on several of the profiles. Despite this hard evidence, Murphy chose to stay blind to Lana's lies. She's got three profiles on this Russian website, he said looking over the email. These links are all bullshit. He then sent the investigator a picture of himself and Lana with the message, case closed. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.